Previously on The Legend of Zelda, Majora's Mask. Here's to me! That's right, Kokichi Link! The greatest of all links! Oh my god! I feel fantastic, Tattle. Ah, uh, you look pretty crunk to me there, Link. No, I'm not crunk. You're, you're crunk. Hey, you're, you're pretty. I would never tell you that. Ew, no! Ew, no! Mama play for the song. Here I go. La 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 la. Thank you all very much. Good night. And now back to. And now back to. And now back to. Go be back with some more Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. All right, let's go and pause it. We don't waste time. When we last left off, we entered the land of the Ikana Valley, where we ran to a little girl with a big nose and freckles. It was cute. It was kind of cute, honestly. But she was trying to protect her dad, who was uh, turned to a zombie or a redead. Uh, it was it was cute. I, I like that scene where uh, we actually like got him back to normal and they hugged each other. It was like, oh. Oh, it was sweet. And speaking of that, you guys, uh, one of you guys uh, had a really interesting comment regarding that. Kaya alone, who last episode said, There's something I really like about the whole story with Link helping Pamela and her father. Each of the four lands in Termina, the four worlds they call them, has people associated with them. Link ends up helping each of them in some form, but he can't save everyone. Link helps the Deku people of the Southern Swamp, but the Deku butler's son is long gone before Link entered the swamp, even before Link entered Termina at all. And whether he even realizes this connection with this unfortunate Deku is entirely up to chance, just like it is for the player. Next, Link helps the Goron people of Snowhead Mountain, but he only meets their hero, Dormani, as a spirit who died not that long ago trying to fight against Goat. Dormani even hopefully asks if Link can use his match to bring him back to life, but all he can do is put his spirit at ease. When Link helps the Zora people of the Great Bay, he actually encounters the hero McCall while he's still alive. However, Link is still too late as McCall is already mortally wounded by the dawn of the first day. Just like before, all he can do is let his spirit rest and finish what McCall started. But even victory is bittersweet knowing McCall will never be able to truly play with his band again, nor be with the woman he loves and see her children grow up. And then Link arrives in Akana Canyon, the land of the undead. One could assume that it was possibly once the land of the humans, the fourth people of Termina. But regardless of what it truly was, it's all in ruins now and only the undead are living there. It's the most desolate and hopeless place Link has entered during the journey. He's constantly attacked by the spirits of ninjas, living corpses, roam the land, and all the spirits seem restless in some way, with the ghost of Sharp specifically re resisting the song of healing that would always help Link in these situations before. Interesting, I I didn't even think about doing that, but that, that's, that's cool that they would actually add that little detail in there. And yet it is the seemingly hopeless land where Link finally just barely arrives in time. He manages to free Pamela's father from the curse, happily reuniting him with his daughter. Just this once, Link is able to save an innocent life. Wow, really, really interesting analysis there, Kyle Lone. I hadn't even thought about that. It's true, and how they ended up sort of saving it for last, this one area that is already already essentially ruined, but you still manage to go there and find some form of hope. Nobody befalls a tragedy, nobody becomes your new Transform Mask in this area. Although you do get a mask of some form, right? But it's not from the dead spirit of someone who's already been taken from this world. Really, really interesting. I, I really enjoyed reading your comment, Kyle Lone. And it is for that reason you are comment of the day. I know I've said this a bunch of times already, but seriously, you guys have left such great comments during this series. It's really been real delight of mine just to read through all the different uh, bits of lore, things that maybe aren't brought up in the game, um, little things that I might have missed. Which, by the way, you guys did say I, I could actually um, return to where Pamela and her father live and talk to them. For some more uh some additional information so i think i'm actually gonna go do that i also heard some of you guys recommend like to get a lot of green potions uh because the next area is very magic intensive i think i'm gonna do even better though i think i think i'm gonna go and get a chateau romani which i think i i'm hoping i can still get on the first night here and that'll actually allow me to to open up this pathway too which i, I can't seem to do from this side okay yeah i didn't really think about that honestly <laughs> i guess it would i guess they wouldn't just stand there and hug each other for for three days straight. At some point, they're gonna talk to me, right? Oh, see, this little girl's so cute. I don't know, just, just she's got such like a funny little design. Just sort of a large nose and these little freckles. Oh, uh, what did you do? What you did for my father? Thank you. But you helped me. It's, it's a secret from my father. Whenever anything strange happens, my father immediately starts talking about doing research. And he does all kinds of crazy things, so. Once he calms down a bit, I think I'll try to convince him to quit researching this dangerous place and to go back to town. 
So, if my father sees you again, I'm sorry. I, if your father, wait, what? Your strange power, if father's- Oh, oh, it, oh, I see. I see. Father sees that, he'll surely want to research it. That's why I don't really want you to meet my father. I'm sorry to say such a thing. Oh, okay. Oh, will you ask me to leave then if I try to go down there? Ah, oh. See, that's actually like, that's really like a thoughtful amount of detail that makes sense. And it's, it's something very sort of heartbreaking about that too. You know, like the savior here, like I can't reveal who I am or that I was, that actually saved him for that reason. It's, that's, there are a lot of moments like that in this game that I've noticed. And it's really, it's really interesting. I'm, so, okay, if I go down here, will she just like push me away? Or if I try to do anything, like, play a song. Oh, isn't this a fairy? Is this yours, young man? I am the famed academic who researches fairies, ghosts, and similar so-called supernatural phenomena. By the way, the song, Farewell to Gibdos, which the music box is now playing, drives away Gibdos. Oh, okay, so we, okay, we do actually get some reason behind that. I discovered it after many years of researching Gibdos. In regards to ghosts, there isn't another academic who can match my knowledge. So ask me anything you like. Uh, it's been some time since I've seen a fairy l this lively. Say, young man, would you permit me to do research on this fairy? T <laughs> sure have at it. No! I swear to God, if you touch me, you're dead! I did have something I say I should, like, whip out some of my, my mask in front of him. Why don't I show him the, the one that I that he was wearing? Oh, that mask is certainly a gift, though. Young man, where'd you get that? From you, silly. Hmm. The more I look at it, the more this mask looks like a real Gibdo. Gibdo to me. This mask could probably convey your feelings to Gibdos. Perhaps you could even investigate the Gibdo life form itself. Say, young man, would you permit me to do research on that mask? <laughs> would you see only? I wonder if you only react to that one. Like, would you react to the react to the fey mask? No. Okay, I had some of you guys try doing a, a transformation one. Hey, look what I can do! Ah, woo! Oh! Hmm. Ghost radar is reacting fiercely. But it's my, this is minutely different from its usual response. It's a very intriguing response. Oh, interesting. Reacting to the spirit. Is, I mean, I, I'm guessing it probably says that for all of them then. Hmm. You seem to be both similar to a ghost and different from one at the same time. This is very intriguing. Remain here a while, permit me to research you. Okay. This is also sort of, it's making things become clearer, right? Why they're here. The father is so infatuated with researching and understanding the world that he's willing to go get into harm's way and even bring his daughter with him, right? To, to do it. Risk life and limb. And the daughter is, is there to look after him, preventing him from trying to make sure he doesn't get into too much trouble. It just seemed weird that these two would be out here. Hmm. You seem to be both similar to a ghost and different from one at the same time. Very intriguing. Okay. Hey, what about now? Hey, can you see me? I'm invisible, right? You know, I kind of wish, uh, this would have been a really tiny detail, a tiny detail, but that would have been really cool if, uh, if when you put this mask on, the NPCs didn't see you at all, so when you tried to talk to them, they would just be, like, talking to themselves and hear their inner thoughts. I thought that that would be really cool. I know been a lot of, that would have been a lot of work, but, you know, I... By the way, oh, that's right, something I wanted to say, so, you know what the last dungeon kind of makes me sort of, like, sort of realize, and I, like, I really see the, uh, the rushing feeling of the developers in the last dungeon, with the Gibdos blocking the door that you get to give random knickknacks, like, that's a really kind of, was kind of a lazy dungeon, to be honest, it was like, okay, you're, the, the thing blocking your path is a Gibdo who wants a specific object that might be in there, might not be in there, and that's, that's the puzzle, that's it. And you just gotta go around finding and give it to them. Like that was that was easily the worst dungeon for me. And I know it wasn't like a full dungeon, just kind of a mini part of it, but that definitely screamed of uh padding. And yes, I think it was worse than the uh than the Great Bay Temple. Yes, that one could be very frustrating, but at least it was clever with a lot of its puzzles. Like, aside from some reused assets, in terms of gameplay itself, I didn't really see a whole lot of like that feeling of like, oh man, this game was really rushed out, right? until that moment and then i was like oh look at this shit like this is this is game padding 101 right so I'm, I'm hoping the next main temple isn't that are you curious about the picture that is a mummified man its scientific name is gibdo a tale in a tells of a treasure that rests at the bottom of the well on the hilltop 
Through the spirits of those who became Gibdos upon entering the well in search of that treasure still linger inside. Oh, I know, man. Trust me, I know. It's been said going down there is a petrifying experience. So even the mummy hunter may become mummified. Oh! And that's right. That's how you ended up happening to you, huh? You went down there, didn't you, you silly booger? I even, oh, I even tried to go into that well once myself. Mm. Strangely enough, though, I don't remember anything that happened there. Well, you never know what might happen, so it's simply best not to approach it. Interesting. Are you curious about that picture? That is the ghost of a ninja. His scientific name is Garo Robe. They are merely shells that are empty on the inside. They're the shells of a spies from an enemy nation sent to investigate Akana. They have been unable to forget their living days. Even now, their spirits, emptiness cloaked in darkness, continue to spy. And I wonder, actually, if I go back in time again, will this guy still will turn back into a mummy? Like, I feel he should, but if I played the Song of Healing, wouldn't that make another mask again? I, I think it might end up being, like, what happened with Macau, and he's just, by this point, stays either dead or, in his case, stays alive. What are the rumors? Those garments frequently appear near the ranch on the far side of town. Oh, wait, oh, God. Well, they are said to be shells, and Garros are still ninja, and they will not show themselves in front of people. Mm. Those are... Yet there are many sightings near the ranch. That's strange. Oh, ho, ho, ho. yes, the Br Gorman brothers. They put on the hoods of those ninjas. Interesting. I love, I love how much detail is here. If you choose to find it, you know, like you could skip all this. You could totally miss all this easily. But if you go back and and check it out, it's like, it's, I don't know. It's just really, really, really interesting. Oh. Oh, it's already night. I I, just, I forgot it's already nighttime. That means if I want to get that uh, Chateau Romani, I gotta go now. I, for some reason, I thought it was five five p.m., not five a.m. Okay, I think I'm. I think I'll be all right. I think it closes at the dawn of the next day, so as long as I get there before then. Oh, or not. Opens from ten p.m. Oh, good. Okay, I I went ahead and just reloaded uh, reloaded my game again, and uh, I'm guessing I must close at five or something. All right, there we go. Yeah, I'll take some regular milk while I'm here. All right, bottoms up, baby. Ooh! Ah, oh, yeah, that's the shit right there. Like, I think you might be becoming an alcoholic. Shut up! A very belligerent alcoholic. Okay, when I went back to rewatch uh, and edit last episode, I, I did realize what the uh, uh, the switch over here was doing. It was turning a light on that I can use to get past this block over here. Now, behold! Get out of my way, dumb stone! Come on! Am I not, am I not doing it? Oh, there we go. I said I'd be really close to the edge there. So it seems like I can get on the roof of this thing. I'm not sure if there's a grapple spot or... I see some flowers, too. Some deck of flowers. It might be you just have to go around. Or, like, go in from the inside and then travel to the top. Alright, guys. Well, I think it's time to head inside. See what crazy shit has evolved with this place. Is this so? Oh, hello! Uh. Hello there, Mr. Zombies. Will this work on you guys? Whoa, what? <laughs> what? What did he do? <laughs> oh, that's right! They talk about them being uh, part of a dance troupe. Great <laughs> damn, I catch you as paralyzing going to be removed! Shit out of your get gone! I I say I I think it's fine, look! I think you're my friends! <laughs> oh fuck man, I'm keeping this shit on then! I wanna fuck with you guys, as long as I have to kill you. I can't tell is this is actually the next temple or not. Or if this is just like a a mini dungeon. In addition on top of the other mini dungeon. Okay, uh... Oh shit, that's right, I forgot. I, uh... I'm gonna need a powder keg, right? Ah, uh, I should probably go get that. Because it, it's clear, they said, he it mentioned it, one of the Sheikah Stones said it, right? And I, I don't want to go all the way into this place and then go, Oh shit, I should have gotten that when I had the chance, you know? So, alright, let's go and just, let's go back again, let's grab the powder keg. I don't know if it was a necessary part of the of the dungeon, or merely uh, something you get a bonus thing or like a heart piece. But better safe than sorry, right? Yeah, I gotta say what? <laughs> I wonder why they decided to change the the mirror shield shield's design to this scary ass face. They, they just felt like they didn't have enough dark ass shit in this game. <laughs> I 
<laughs> it's so fucking funny. I feel like it's like gonna come in from the ceiling here. That oh, hey, it's another one. <laughs> it's so funny. It's so random. The developers that are making this game. It's like yes, we, we have some at least some funny stuff in here, right? All right, now the second day. Uh oh, I've actually got a map of this area already. Yes, this definitely isn't the temple. This is something else. It's just, yeah, it's the manor. It's the Akana's manor, which is still part of Akana, I guess. Well, hello there, mister. Oh, hey! Oh, you just punched me in the face! Uh-oh. Fine, you want some of this? Hit me! Ah! Eat shit, bitch! Oh, crap! That's right, you guys are in the Ocarina of Time, too. They're the ones that come from the ceiling and the ones that are just standing around going out their fucking day! Ah! He's sucking the air life energy for me! <laughs> ah, stop tickling me now! Now! I'm gonna drop a lot of rupees, too. Uh, okay, well, we got a block, but. No light to use on it. Hello, dancing! Free dead. Enjoy your time here. I have no quarrel with you. Uh, what do we got going on? Uh oh. Oh lord. It's gonna be one of those. Alright, I choose you, Pikachu. Yeah! Oh no, that just crushed the shit out of me, didn't it? Yeah, it did. Can I really not crawl on top of this? This looks like I should be able to just jump up. Okay, I see what it is. So I gotta pick a spot that has a hole. This didn't automatically kill me. Uh, I see a hole right there. That's the hole of that thing. Okay, so. Ah! Oh god, that would be a bad way to go. Uh, looks like they all get covered up. Oh, I, I just gotta be fast. I think that's that's what it's telling me. Must move quickly. Uh. Ah! Oh, that. Uh, oh. <laughs> okay. And squish! That worked great! Didn't even launch me high enough to get over there! Do I, oh, do I have to pick the one slightly... Aren't these two the same distance from it, though? Not moving fast enough, gonna die! Ah! Blech. You know, I was gonna make a V3 joke about this. I'm just gonna leave it to you guys to piece it together. Oh, wait, I know. That's right, the, the Zora form makes me a little taller. Unless this is, like, hot and I just can't get up it. Oh, come on. Are, are these things like on fire or lava or something? I feel like there's no reason I shouldn't be able to just walk on top of this. Oh, I do, it's, it's, no, it is glowing, isn't it? Which means red hot death or something. I don't know. I, I wish they made it a little clearer than that. I don't know how to get up there though. Let's see if I can reach it. Oh, I got it. I just barely got it. I was thinking, like, this has to be possible, right? Okay, so, is this gonna hurt me? Yeah, okay, it did. At least I know now. Okay, we got stuff going on here. Oh God, no. No, no, no. No you don't, bitch. You ain't gonna get me today. These guys are littered all over the fucking place. Infinite magic, bitch. I can shoot you with fire all day long. And not get winded. There's a button over there, I don't know if I can actually get to it though. I guess I can get over there, otherwise, otherwise uh, this is gonna be impossible. Yeah, there we go. Okay, I hope it's not a time limit. Uh, how do I get back though? Oh, and it resets the room. Oh, that's the issue, is getting back over here. Oh, hey! Oh my god, look at that. Well, hello, Mr. Hidden Platform. Icy Platform at that. <laughs> I was like, how is this possible? That's how they get you. Ah! Or like that. Piece of crap, spider. I'm walking on sunshine. Whoa. There we go. Uh oh. Ah, damn it, I got jinxed. You jinxed me, bitch! Oh no, do these guys just keep coming back? Piece of crap. Actually, I think that uh, one ghost said that I can actually play the uh, uh, the Song of Storms to get rid of curses, right? Will that work for this? Hey! 
Yeah, it did! Ha! That's cool. Alright. Oh, here we go. Now I'm on the roof. Oh, it looks like we got another ghosty who wants to fucking fight me, huh? What is that? You want to die today, bitch? These things are all over the damn place. Like cockroaches. Invisible demon and cockroaches. You can die in a single swing of the sword. And have helpful tips. To counter the rage of the king of Akana Castle, burn away that which disrupts the light and shine the sicker rays on the king. Uh, okay. Thanks for the tidbit there. Uh, okay. We've got that. And a heart piece. Ooh, but if I fall, I'm gonna have to walk all the way back up here again, right? Which would kind of suck. Oh, there's a spot right there. I'm gonna need the probably the, the big uh, uh, gunpowder kick for. All right, let's give this a shot. Ah. Woo! There we are. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go back around though, unfortunately. Actually, it looks like I probably have to come back down here anyway. So I probably could have just gone blown that up, then got this before moving on, but whatever. Tell me that door stayed unlocked. Damn it, it didn't. Motherfucker, are you kidding me? Okay, we got a button over here. Again, could I actually get back though after I've leapt over there? There we are. Oh, those fucking crows better touch me. Where was that hole exactly? Was it on the roof or was it on the floor? Oh, it's right there. But how do I get over there? Do I just have to toss the bomb over this fence to get in? The powder keg? I am safe stating in case this shit doesn't work. Oh, yes siree, baby! Now to sit back and watch the fireworks. Okay, okay. Oh, hello there, sorry. Forgot to put my, put my face on. There we go, everybody's happy now. Hope you guys don't mind. I use your light. Oh god, the light does kill him! I just like walk past him like, hey guys, how's it going? Did it, did it, oh no! Go catch you like why? Uh, I'm sorry, god, oh man. I'm just a clumsy sod, aren't I? <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. I like how I do it without even aiming. Oh god. We're about to go to a mini boss. Uh, I am in the throne room. And I see light in that window. Uh oh. Oh, it's this one who has brought the unthinkable into a land as dark as Akana. My servants have fallen namesake for the light that guides you. Yeah, sorry about that. I kind of forgot I had this thing on my back. However, the darkness in which my servants live is, after all, fleeting. You shall see with your own eyes. Oh, God! The kind of thing true darkness really is! Darkness! <laughs> oh, shit! Okay, okay. So, actually, as you guys tell me, apparently, uh, when I reach the next boss, I should apparently first try uh, equip the Bremen, Bremen mask and march. Uh... Hey guys, guys, look what I can do! Oh my god! Everybody gather now! Yay, there's another use for this mask after all! <laughs> Oh my god, that's so fucking awesome! Like the dance in perfect, perfect rhythm to it. Da -da -da -da. That was good, guys. Good. Well done. <laughs> okay. And the other one, I should wear the uh, the captain's mask. Will they just not fight me with this? Hey, how's it going? Can I talk to you? Or do I come? Oh, do I come to you? Hey, how's it going? It's me, your captain. Oh, Kita. So not Captain Keita. Oh my God! Yes. <laughs> but you're so tiny! <laughs> oh my God! It's nearly full by what you have done. 
Oh, oh, okay. Ah! I, it, okay, at first I thought he was saying he he actually believed it was Kita. I, I almost killed you. Now he was saying, oh, wait, no, you're not Kita. You almost tricked me. Oh, my God. That, wow, that's a hell of attention to detail. I like that. That's cute. Okay, let's kill you guys now. Die, I have defeated your elite warriors. Oh wait, the curtains are here. I'm gonna need to set that shit on fire, aren't I? Time to burn, baby, burn. Yeah! Let the light in! Ah! He's like, oh shit. Can we not do this, please? Come at me! Oh, he can block, they can block the light, interesting. Can we get some new curtains in here, please? Ah, damn it. So that's sort of the problem with the lock on button being the same button they used to center your camera. Like, I just wanna, I don't wanna face towards them. I want to, I want to face this direction, but I can't turn my camera either. So all I can do is, am I hitting you? No? I'm not hitting you, oh, I gotta, I gotta knock you guys down again. Don't I? Taste the light. There we go, dead! Now you're next, Jack Skellington. Aha! How about thee? Ow, fuck! Hey, you know what, I'm not fighting. Did it, did it. <laughs> come on, come at me, man, I'm totally unarmed. I can't do anything. Stick with using the basic target methods while defending. He's different to break than those two lackeys, though. Yeah, he knows he's, he's not stupid though. He's like, I'm not can't come into that that area. This is the area of no return. That's right, bitch. Yeah, come at me. Come at me, stupid. Fine, I'll kill your head. Ah! Oh, I missed. Ow! <laughs> Die! Die, Captain! Shit. You're blocking me! Get out of the way! I just don't get up! Blame blocking you! There is a BS cause you are so feeble! Don't blame this on me! Alright, let's try and say it again on my body race! I'll bite your legs off! I don't have legs! Fimo! 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 Shut up already! Oh, don't look at me! I was always calling my swordsman all the color! Ah, dick! Sans Papyrus! Calm yourself! Guy swordsman all the color! You Fimo! Fimo! Everybody! Fimo! Draw your weapon! I can't draw my weapon! Huh? I'm telling you, draw your sword! How? <laughs> waka waka, you two are a pair, aren't you? <laughs> Will you stop you? What fools? Haven't you begun to understand? What disembodied heads? What kind of being ruined and us left in this state? Isn't it petty? Little battles like this have caught that have caused it. Believing in your friends and embracing that belief by forgiving failure. These feelings have vanished from our hearts. It all happened after somebody thrust open the doors of that stone tower. You who bring light into darkness. I am the king of the Kana kingdom. Egos do Kana. Spellbinding that had been cast upon us was broken by that light which you carry. Really? Because I thought it was just the light that was outside. Shut up! A big poetic! To return true light to this land, you must seal the doors of Stone Tower where the winds of the darkness blow through. But Stone Tower is an impenetrable stronghold. Hundreds of soldiers of my kingdom would not even be able to topple it. It's far too reckless for one to take on such a challenge. And so, I grant you a soldier who has no heart, one who will not falter in the darkness. Ah. Uh, 
Oh, okay. Get some new song. Another new song. The Elegy of Emptiness. What am I doing? Oh, I mean, like a little... Oh, what the fucking nightmare fuel is that? It's a mystical song that allows you to shed a shell shaped in your current image. By playing the song while wearing masks, to assume different forms, you'll be able to leave up to four empty shells, one for each form. What the fuck? A soldier who has no heart is your twin image. Shell of yourself. No, I think I look a little better than that. <laughs> ah! Yes, hello there. I'm the Dr. Hardy Zelda. Oh, God. I was the rejected Zelda for this Let's Play. <laughs> shell of yourself. These shells will shed when your song commands it. Anyway, I'm back to being dead. On my kingdom, shine the light of justice. Of justice! I don't- Oh my god, what the fuck is this? Look at that face! <laughs> okay, that was just designed to be Nightmare Fuel, alright? Come on. Oh my god! Ah, oh, Is this a meme? I feel like this has meme written all over it. I've never seen anything like this. What the fuck? It's so weird looking! Die! Die, fake cookie you like! I don't want it. No. Great, he has the ability to stand on things. To stand on a switch or something? Oh yeah, that was, that was my final song, wasn't it? Yay! LG of emptiness. Yay, I'm dead inside. Yay! Uh, okay. So what do I, uh, what, 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 what do I do with you? I shine light on you. Light in the dark, heart bark. Ha! Now I'm the king now. That's right. King Coach Kishki Link. Yay! Yay! Everybody's cheering. Yay! Yay! I go down to see my people. My person, I mean. And it's just me. All right, guys, I killed your king. Hope that's all right. Oh, uh, oh, cool. You're like this one too. Nice. Yay! I'm dancing with you. Yay! Yay! Oh, guys, what happened? Now it's no time for us. This is no time for a nap, boys. All right. We're dancing off with the redef from across the way. We can't lose now. Okay, I guess. Am I done here then? All right. The stone tower is over here. Should I do this now, though? I, I think. I think I better reset the day. I I feel like, okay, so that was just like a mini dun dungeon before we head to the main temple, right? And just based on how long the last one took and seeing how this is, I think, supposed to be the final one in the game, right? I don't assume there's anything after this, aside from the final battle with uh, Majora. I think it's probably better if I uh, reset the day and just so I have the most amount of time when I jump into this. Oh, but that means I'm gonna have to buy the, ah, but then I'll have to buy the fucking Chateau Romani again. I have to get another milk. And then I lose all my stuff here with the fairies and stuff. You know what? Fuck it. I, I'm going for it. This might be a bad idea, but I'm going for it. We're like halfway through the second day. I could do this. Maybe. Probably not. Whoa, what the? Uh oh. Uh, what does that accomplish exactly? Uh oh. Oh, I need to play my song here. Don't I? So it makes. Oh yeah, so I will be actually having you guys stay on switches for me. Yeah. Creepy Link, guard this spot. I don't really know what that's account. It's moves that. Well, okay, there's probably other switches then, right? Woo! Oh, oh God, you things again. Taste my laser, it says. Come on, hit me. I can reflect that laser back at you, I think. Maybe. Oh, actually, no, I remember. I just. I can just blow you guys up, like, yeah, there we go, like that. Whoa, what the hell? <laughs> what? That blew, that exploded, like, instantaneously, what the hell? Oh, raises that one up. So, is that I can also do it in my different forms, huh? And that... Wait, what? What just happened? Oh, 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 I see. I, it will actually, re I, okay, I thought I meant when it said that it, uh, it made it a different form. I thought maybe the different weight of the different forms would affect it, but it's what it means is I can have a, a total of uh, four different forms out at once. I thought it just meant I could have four forms of any type. 
Oh, got it. Is this gonna look weird too? Yes, sir. Oh, oh, it's Dormani's spirit. Well, I mean, I, I am, I do look like Dormani already, but I mean, that, that actually looks like Dormani without like my, all my goofy hat and stuff. Okay, got another button. Raise it up and oh, oh, there we go. Oh, I see it and now I can get across this way. And this one will probably look more like Macau did. Yeah, oh my God, it's a terrifying zombie. Okay, oh, and now we got three buttons here, but I, now that I've reached the spot, I don't need the uh, the other buttons, right? Oh man, I'm going, this thing's pretty high up here. Oh, 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 oh. No, these three buttons are to go back the way I just came. I was like, why aren't the buttons changing or doing anything? That's, yeah, they're just re-putting the platforms where they were, but if they're already there, then it's not going anywhere. Oh, okay, we got another thing there. Uh. Okay, this one pulls that one out. Add that one too. It's a pretty clever mechanic, I gotta say. I just kinda wonder, will the Deku form even be uh, powerful enough to actually sit on the button? Or heavy enough, I mean? Oh, and here comes that one. Nice right, find out. Let's put this one on and... Nope. But what if I, if, what if I play the song? I was kind of curious to see what this one looks like. Oh look, a little Deku scrub. Oh, he's so cute. No, he's still he's still not uh, heavy enough though. Ah oh, crap, I'm not gonna play it again. Makes me wonder then what use is he gonna play? Oh, maybe because he's a Deku scrub. Can I can I hook shot to him? Because he's made of wood. Oh no. Oh damn, that would be a pretty cool mechanic there. Kind of like making your own scarecrow. All right, I can cross. Woo! There's a whole lot of redeads over there, and oh my god, we got a uh scarecrow scarecrow spot. Shit, do I have the song now? Oh, I do, I do have the song. Couldn't remember if I had it on this run or not. I like him over here. Look, 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 look at me, I'm dancing. Look at me. I see you, okay, God, just stop wiggling. Oh. I didn't even see my ridicule on him. Oh god, no, 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 no. Look, I'm your friend! I'm your friend! Ah! Holy crap, that lag. Uh, what does this get me? Do I have to kill you guys? Oh, you you betrayed me! Ah! Oh. Seriously, what did I accomplish? Can I... Oh, can I get to one of these other spots now? Like, faster than I could before? Uh... I see literally no reason to come up here. Unless, oh, is there a hidden wall? Yeah, I I don't see anything. I thought, well, maybe it'll help me get up the tower faster or something, but I, it doesn't seem to be. Unless you count killing those guys to get a little bit of cash or something, which I wouldn't. Oh, we got another scare, scare, scarecrow spot. Does that actually make another scarecrow or does it just move the old one? I think it just moves it. Okay, I got some berries. Yeah, I guess it's it. I guess it just like, Areas to get some pots and stuff. Ow. Oh my god, Mr. Owl! Ah! You are free! Hey, bitch! You looking for me? Hell yeah, I have. Oh man. God, it's already 9 p.m. on the second day and I haven't even gotten in the temple yet. Oh. Okay, now I'm not sure if I want to go in there yet. When I still. I mean, I can fast travel back here now. Okay, just based on how long the last one was, I think I have to reset the day. I just, it's just too big of a risk, I think. I really would suck to go in there to run out of time, right? And then have to do it all over again. But it does mean I, if I plan to get uh, Chateau Romani, I'm gonna have to wait till at least 10 o'clock today. But you guys said it was pretty magic intensive, so it sounds like it, it would be a worthy uh, investment. Actually, I think I might have found a good way to farm for money now that I think about it. If I those guys kept dropping, the reed deck kept dropping like 20 rupees. Usually what I kept doing was going to this bird and shooting him like a million times to get 200 rupees, but it still kind of takes a while. This one actually in Kana Canyon might be, might be a better choice. Yeah, so as soon as they don't fight back at all. Okay, I'm good to go, I think. This time I am going prepared in, to this dungeon. So I got four milks, a fairy, and I just have myself the Chateau Romani. So hopefully I should be good to go now. All right, let's go ahead and get these platforms. Uh, oh. Uh, wait. 
What's up with that? That's not gonna help me get over there. Yeah. Maybe, only, maybe one of these buttons I don't stand on. Ah! Oh my god! No! <laughs> Woo! Or do I have to like go in a certain order? Oh no, it does. You have to do it in a specific order, because if you don't, one of the blocks will get in the way of the other block of where it's trying to go. Yeah, there we go. Woo! There we go. All right. You must be a Kana Temple. Let us see how this goes. Hopefully better than the last one. Stone Tower Temple. Okay, I see dragonflies. I see bomb rats. Suicidal bomb rats. Wait, what the hell is he doing? Why, wow, he really wants to kill me, doesn't he? Too bad he's gonna kill himself here. Maybe. Oh, maybe not. I guess his little bomb thing doesn't uh, explode after a period. Okay, that was simple. Oh, how the fuck did you actually get over to me? Oh, I see a sun that needs some sunlight. Get out of here. Pull me over here, Mr. Chest. Uh, and first three fairy, all right. Oh, got a button up there. The ceiling of that thing. Oh, am I gonna be like reversing gravity or something? So I might be turning things upside doodly here. Okay, let's see what we got going on over here. Boom. Got the button. Single button, three buttons. Oh, big button for the Goron form. Okay, is one of these light enough for the Deku form? Four buttons that I'm gonna need to stand on, let's see. Not that one. It'd be ironic that the big one was actually light enough for that now. I don't think I can do this then. Unless I just need to have all four of them and then stand on this one and then it'll open and stay open. I don't know. There's also a button on the ceiling there though. I might also need. Oh, yeah, I gotta say, I kind of wish the uh, the process of making another clone wasn't so time consuming. Like, seriously, it's like 10 to 15 seconds you have to wait before you get a new clone to show up. I mean, you know, between playing the song and then waiting for it to actually show up. Can I stay on this one? And it did open. Will it stay that way? Nope, and it shuts fucking immediately. Okay. Now, fortunately, I can't, the Deku form is just not gonna be heavy enough. Okay, that's not gonna work. Okay, go to this side then. Oh, okay. <laughs> Man, go somewhere or not. I ain't got no light. Okay, that's gonna be like a shortcut problem once you've unlocked something over that side. What am I supposed to be doing here exactly? Do I need to be daytime so that uh, the light from the sun can give me light to cast on stuff? No, it's overcast. I am not quite sure what to do here. Oh, 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 there's a bomb wall over here. Boom. Oh, and I see an upside down chest. Uh, which I cannot get to. Okay, I don't think that really helped me in this situation here. Oh, wait, can I put a box on one of these buttons to keep it down? Oh, I can. There we go. That's how you do this. So let the little rat bastards blow it up. Ooh, they do not make some of these puzzles easy. I mean, I get that it, it's like, okay, putting box on button, that's not that hard, but it's more that the way the game kind of tricks you into thinking, okay, I'm just gonna do what I did before where I put the forms down, but I like, I have just four buttons and four forms, but the deco form is not heavy enough. So you're not like, oh, well, it must be some other way to get the form down or, or something. I don't know. I'm sorry if you didn't see that bomble wall there. And that's the only place where these boxes are. Okay, there we go. Got going on over here. Locked door. Deadly dragonfly of freaking doom. Come at me, bitch. Ah! Yeah, this is definitely going to involve a rotating this place. Uh... I can like spring to life, are they? Okay, we got a sunblock. 
Can I grab these? Oh, I can't grab them. Can't seem to move it anywhere. Oh, do I need to do it in my Goron form? No? Uh oh. Not those fucking things again. Rah! That shit out of my house! Uh. Okay, I killed them. Did that accomplish anything? Oh! Is that a scarecrow? Damn it! I don't have the scarecrow song anymore because I reset the day. That's just pretty dark, but now I. Oh no, it's a grappling hook. Don't tell me you still figured it out! Oh, 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 yeah, okay. Don't tell me that stupid baka! Well, at least Towel's nice enough to freaking show me. There we are. Oh, just a fairy. Uh, no, uh, no, then I, d I don't understand what you're trying to say, Tattle. She's trying to say I need light in here, but does it need to be daytime? Okay, what the hell, I'm in here. What do I do? There's no light, though. Oh god, this feels like it's gonna be one of those dungeons. The uh, what the fuck am I supposed to do kind of dungeons. Fuck, I have no idea. There's no other place to go. Like, you know, it's moments like this that really give me problems with recordings when I'm like, and I make it so I'm unable to post the next day because it's like, it's, especially this game in particular has really been tough on me. I'm not saying it's gonna happen yet, but I'm like barely into this thing and I'm already like, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. The thing is it's daytime and it's not like light is shining out of this thing. Do I have to wait till like mid noon or something? Oh my God. Oh, oh my God. Okay. Wow, they could have put some cracks on that. I Okay, I mean, I get it. I get why it was done that way, I guess. To make you try to observe your surroundings and figure it out that way. Does one have anything? No. That, oh, that this is connected to that other area down there. Honestly, though, I, that didn't even occur to me. I just thought, oh, this looks like something maybe I could blow up. I, I don't know. I, look, I was reaching that point of, I have no idea what I'm trying, what I'm supposed to do here. I'm just gonna try everything. And I, I fucking came across it, but god dang it. Really could have appreciated some, I don't know, just some kind of cracks there. I still feel like would have made it a little, I mean, I don't know. I, mean, I guess you could say it would have made it too easy, but, but I mean, having like other things that are bombable, most things that are bombable have cracks on it, right? Having one that is bombable, but doesn't have cracks on it. Like you wouldn't think to, that it could, that you could blow it up, you know? Like I get the idea of, okay, let the fi player figure it out themselves, but through visual cues. And that's what Tao was trying to tell me, but by doing it this way, it also sort of goes against the rules that we've already set up. I don't know, I don't know, it's just me, but. I wouldn't be surprised if other people struggle with that too, though. <laughs> At least I hope so. I hope it's not just me. We thought that was a little, a little vague. Oh. Guys, gonna spring to life. Yep. Boom. Boom. Uh oh. All right, we got a big chest. What's in here? Oh, it's a map. Great. That isn't really what I uh need though. I mean, map's nice, but uh, shit. Damn it! Now what do I do? That's not progression though. I've got this light. Does it do anything else? Oh, actually, that door closed. How do I even get back out of here then? I don't have a key. Does it mean it's got me? There's a key on this side somewhere. Otherwise, I'm stuck. What the fuck? Now what do I do? All I did was get me a map. That didn't help me at all. Aside from, oh my god, this is gonna be one of those. This is gonna be fucking one of those. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What if I kill all these statues? I, I think I only killed those two right there. Maybe the point is then kill these, these ones here too. Yes, okay, okay. I was just say, motherfucker, what do you want from me? Okay, small key, there we go. It's like, if I don't find a small key on this side, I'm kind of fucked. 
I won't be able to get out of here unless I teleport, which I really don't want to do. Okay, now I can go to this spot. Does this take me back around again? Uh, okay, another sun block. No, different area. What is that over there? That does not look friendly. I think it, I think it's a thing, like a living thing. Oh, time for the Zora form. Ain't done with you yet, son. Ah, be where the hand. Oh yeah, that is a something. What the fuck? Some weird cyclops thing with arms and legs. Oh, okay, we got a golden chest over here. And a big old nasty hand that can suck my balls. Boom. Okay. A uh, button on the ceiling. Can I press it from the floor? No. Whoa, hello. Oh my god. <laughs> this place is big. There's a lot going on here. Oh, okay, I see a, a button surrounded by mines. Can I blow up the mines with like my magic power for my body? That works. Fortunately, it is upside down. And Link is unable to open upside down chests. I don't have that ability yet. Like stupid fucking plant things. Die, you piece of shit. Okay, uh. What's going on here? Another locked door? Oh, hello there. Oh, and another upside down chest. Okay, we got some lights with a mirror, I think. It ref reflected off this thing. Can I like move it? Spear so looks different from every every day mirror. Oh, do I have to stand from like the really far right side here and then? I know what I need to do. I just need to get reflect off the mirror and hit the, that sunstone over there. Maybe more of this side. I have to be in like an exact spot or something? Like, what the fuck? This really doesn't seem like it would be very difficult, yet for some reason it is. Just can't get it at the right angle to to hit this. What do I do? What do I do? Oh, wait. Oh, I gotta be fast. That's what I need to do. I need to... Seriously, I... Okay, that, that sort of doesn't make any sense, but okay. So I shine that, I, I guess. Wait. I shine this, and then, like, wait, what did I do? How, how did I do it before? I'm, like, storing light into this or something? Okay, that makes no fucking sense at all. Why exactly? It's a magic mirror or something? We didn't even indicate anything like that. Did we? Did Tattle say something along those lines? Let's see. She, she said it was different from a regular mirror, didn't she? I thought she just meant... Because... Okay. It's different. She, again, not quite enough detail for my liking. I, different in like... I, I mean... It's like... it's. It, I, I get it. I know. You want to figure shit out yourself, but... Oh, still, that is still really vague. It's like different in what way? Okay, the the ways you gotta you gotta. And it is like if I only hold on to it for a little bit, it's only gonna store it for a little bit. So I have to I have to like light this thing for a while for it to sit there for a while and give me enough light to to do shit. Oh man, I don't know. Ooh, oh, jeez, that is that is really obscure. To be honest, but. Okay. Is that compass? Yes, sirree! Oh! Okay, I'm back out here now. Uh, I'm back out here, and I have accomplished nothing. I mean, I've got a map and a compass, but again, does not help me with progression at all. Oh, God. 
Got a sun face there, but there's no light that I can use to get the sun. Uh, even the platform to get to the boss is upside down here. Which seems kind of weird. I think that'd be the thing that was sitting out. I know, I've got to stack boxes together to, to get to the roof somehow. Must use the amazing physics of this game. Oh yeah, this is done. It's a good thing I actually gave myself another day cause, to try to do this, because... I sure as fuck would not be able to do this in a single day. Fuck me. Oh, what the fuck? The hands threw me up here! Are you kidding me? Really? I needed the hand to be alive to chuck me up here? Like, right? I can't- I can't climb up here. Right? I'm not like- I'm not being an idiot, right? I- I can't just pull myself up. No! I need the hand to throw me up there! Okay, now we're starting to get to fuck you territory. That was complete- fucking accident, too, that I came across that, which is kind of how I'm feeling about a lot of this dungeon so far. All right, small key. But it basically means if you kill this guy before you, he grabs you, then it's like you have to leave the area, come back again for him to respawn and chuck you up there. Okay, what about now? What do we got going on? Uh, okay, I got six suns, and oh my god, a freaking lot of mirrors. Get out of here, you little dirt balls. Remind me of those little fuzz balls from uh, Spirited Away. These things. Do I need to, like, kill you guys to get some light in here? Oh, no, there's some light right there. Uh. Oh. Oh, they come back again. Okay. Well, what do I do with you? Blow you up? No, it didn't do anything. Goron form? Oh, yeah. Of course, yeah, because they're like the like things you punched before. Okay. And now, shine the light on you. Uh-oh. Might be doing the thing where only one of these is real and the others are traps or fake ones. There we are. Thank you. Get out of here, you little despot. Oh, that was literally the only real one in here. And had a fairy. Use this thing like that, and shine the way. Oh God, oh, blah. Ooh, another fairy. Okay, got another. I think I'm gonna need to, I have to like double whammy this, right? Oh God, you're gonna have to move fast. Do this, then move like this. Oh shit. Oh, these little dust balls, fuck off. Stop respawning. Seriously, am I supposed to actually have enough fucking time to get to that? This, that doesn't seem possible. Oh man, this this looks fucking frustrating. This looks really frustrating. So you can only put so much light in this thing, I think. And these things keep fucking showing up. Like, like really? This seems like this aim to be as annoying as possible. Fill it up. Run. Fill up this one. You gotta be fast though. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we are. Okay. That one stayed lit up for a lot longer than before. Okay. All right. Okay, these things really should not be respawning again and again. Okay, now what? Uh, fire chest. Fire death below me. Oh, is that like a fan that's going to blow me up or something? Yep, sure does. Oh, we got another fairy. Number five. And I guess to get get back, I gotta fall down and then, oops, climb that ladder over there. Ow! Oh, got a button over here too, and a place to shine a light. What does this do? Bonk! 
Oh, okay. Move quickly. Oh man, what? Seriously? Wow, they do not give me much time. Oh my god. Ser I can't. It's hard to do to move quickly. When you're bouncing across against everything. Come on, come on. There we go. Okay, that please just stay on lit on fire. Don't have a time limit. Okay, blast off. Have the fans blow me. Oh god, oh god. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Blow me up, blow me up. Oh god, don't let that fucking rat hit me. Oh no. No! Ah! Ah! <laughs> On fire! Oh no, please don't. Okay, good. It, it didn't reset the chest, at least. I think it might have been because I was going backwards, which I think I slowed it down some. Uh oh. Shit. Oh! Oh, I'm okay! Oh! That was close. I can still recover even after falling. Ooh, another fairy. Oh dear. What we got going on? I sense, I sense something elusive. <laughs> oh, oh God, it's a super Garo. Where was I put a on a car a mask of my own? Look, I am one of you. He is not phased. That's the guard master. You can't fight him like an ordinary guard. Just dodges his his swords. Oh, there we go. Ah. Okay, you can defend him against my attacks. So. Yeah, okay, just gotta dodge then. Somehow. That's not working. There we go. I guess you can't just dodge spam. That's the point. You gotta dodge at the right time. Ah! Ah! Boom! To think I could be defeated. Oh, my rivalry were spectacular. Check my power by opening my heart and revealing my wisdom. Okay. If you shoot that witch, releases the sacred golden light into the blood-stained red emblem outside the temple. Okay. It shall rearrange its things in which the earth is born in the heavens and the moon is born in the earth. Oh, okay. Do not forget these words. Die, I shall. Leaving no corpse. Boom! Ah! Law of Ascaro. Okay, so you basically get me. What I need to do to, to turn this place over. Ooh, alright. I have no idea what, like, thing I'm gonna get here. Oh, light arrow. Okay. So power your arrows. The light of justice shall target evil. Sweet! I usually get you when I'm fighting Ganon Doodle. I see, okay. So I, d I did actually need to get something. I was like, if I knew that knowledge already, could I have like done it at the start? Uh, oh my god, okay. What am I looking at right now? It's a hip loop. Quickly dodge it if it charges at you. Can't you first do something about that mask it's wearing? Screw it, eat light. Oh, how do I get behind it though? Boom! There we go. Oh god, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. No! Damn it! Can I get back up? Okay, I can. I was trying to pull my sword out, but when you have this this uh, mask on, it that's it does the blow up thing, and your attack gets replaced with explode. Okay, okay. Shut up. Shut up. Boom. It's the power of light. Kingdom Hearts is light. Oh, there's a fairy in here. Oh god, this is kind of like the other area though, where I if I turn the place upside down. It's gonna change the layout and stuff, but it probably means it's also gonna make it impossible to get some of the fairies that I got on this side. Meaning that if I missed any, I'm gonna have to turn it back around again, and oh god. Just means that I hope I don't miss any fairies. Okay, just go ahead and lock the door behind me. Well, hello there, friend. 
takes my life. Ah! So it's so good. So you pay attention to the subtle change to the side. Boom! Can I? Oh! Whoa! You knocked me on top of the fence. Uh oh. Okay, I'm fine. Oh, okay. It still attacks me the moment I get too close. Oh, boom. There we go. Man, I just gotta shoot again. Yeah, there we go. Boom! First time stuns it, and then boom. Another fairy. Seven. Eight more. All right. Oh, now I'm back in this area. So I actually gotta like leave the temple. It's on the outside of it. So the light shining on the red emblem on the outside of the temple. I don't see anything from here. Do I need to? So his eyes there? Can I use the light on these sun things? Oh, I can. Nice. That one. I need to use ice arrows to get across. Oh! Didn't even see a switch over there, but okay. How do I get back out of here? Uh, now it's like I can't get to the ferry, though. It's like, can I fish jump out of this? Oh, I did. Oh. There we go. It was not easy. Okay, number eight. I see a little button down there. Holy shit, that worked! Oh my god, I don't believe that worked. I managed to get through that cage. Okay. I can see that there was a fairy in here. I wasn't sure if I need to rotate the place first, but... Okay, cool. Which, by the way, I still haven't found where that... Where I'm supposed to rotate it. Oh, there it is. Right there. It's on the chin. It's happening behind the, the platforms. God, it was hard to see. How am I going to hit it from here? I think that's it. Oh, yeah. Holy shit. Oh. Whoa, okay. I've fallen upward. What the? Whoa. This is trippy, bro. I'm tripping next, bro. Guess I can't teleport probably out of here after this. Oh. The music actually changed a little bit, too. Okay, there's the boss platform. Oh my god, I can just fall into the freaking sky. How terrifying is that? I was kind of wondering, I was like, how are they going to do this if I... Okay, I see a little sunspot. <laughs> Find a falling, like, what'll happen? I will fall into the fucking outer space. <laughs> okay, fairy number 10. I got another one in here. Oh, uh, that guy's on top of a button. A little robot thing. Oh, it turns him upside down. If I hit that little... Okay. Does that help me at all? Okay. Nuh-uh, mister. Get out of my way. Hey, there's that chest I uh, got from before. Okay, now... <laughs> oh, I see. It's... Blow me upward a little bit. Okay. Oh, a l yeah, more than a little bit. More than a little bit. Okay, I'll blow, you up, blow me up to this thing, which... Ooh. Does it stay that way? Nope. Man, you play a song a lot here. 
Oh, I see another sun. Ah, oh, crap, sort of run low on arrows. Ah, oh, crap, give me a chest, but it's upside down again. Which means I'm gonna have to turn it right side up to get to it, I think, right? Oh god, these things are fucking annoying. Got a button here. Which? Hey! Give me another chest. Small key, okay. How do I get back to the... Oh, I don't need the Deku form to fly, okay. Ah. Oh, that is such a dick move. To put those fucking mines around that thing. Okay, 11, four more. Okay, what we got going on? Oh. Oh, can I turn it over again? I sure can. Hey, now I can get to that chest over there. I think, wait. Wait, what happened? I, w wait, what? Wait, what did I do? I turned around and... So I rotated it. But then I go out the door I came in and it, it just changes it back? How the fuck does that work? Yeah. That's confusing. Okay, and then flip myself back over again. Like a pancake. That's interesting, the lava from above is like falling on your head. Oh god. Okay, I gotta move the block over there. Oh, I see. But you gotta keep rotating the thing. Oop, do it in a core form, I guess. Okay, push it there, then rotate again. <laughs> but if I stood on top of the block, it would just fall down and crush me, right? Like, pfft, ah! Ah, what was I thinking? Oh god, it's already almost the dawn of a final day. That's how long this fucking dungeon takes. Jesus Christ, so long. Dawn of the final day. Don't fucking run out of time, please. There we are. Okay, now what do we got? Oh lord. Oh god, not you again. Ah! Ow. Holy shit, what the fuck is that fire look? That fire looks weird, what the heck? Seriously, that fire looks really weird looking effect to it. I don't have something to do with the texture pack, or what exactly. Where the lava? Ah. Oh my god, seriously. Ah, damn it. There we are. Dead. Ah, seriously, fuck the lava. Okay, what we got? Another fairy! Really? Is that was all I was in here? Well, three left. Oh lord, don't fall into the moon! <laughs> Actually, it'd be really weird if I could see the moon below me, like, staring staring up at me. 
That'd be freaky. Ah. Uh, oh. God, I am so confused. Oh, I'm in the area where there where there was water before. Oh, now I'm now now I'm over where this thing is. Shit. Fuck. Fuck me. What? What am I supposed to do? How do I kill him? Death Armor's Temple Guard. Look at the red mark on the chest. Have you seen something like that before? Yeah, and it turns him upside down, but this doesn't stop him from fucking crushing me when I get over there. He just keeps knocking me off. It's like, motherfucker, what do you... What do you want me to do? The bunny hood? So I don't have to hang on to the edge? Oh god, I got another upside down chest. Can I kill this guy? Is it even possible? No, I don't think I can kill this guy. I don't even know what the point of turning him upside down is. He can still attack me that way. Okay, whatever. I got the button, which activated another chest on the ceiling. Oh, I see. I can knock the bombs into each other, and that blows them up. Interesting. Ah. Oh, my God. This place is really complicated. Okay, now I'm in the little tunnel area. Oh, God, I'm in Jinx. Great. Oh, God. What the fuck? How many- This still isn't the main boss, is it? How many fucking mini-bosses are we gonna have here? Jesus! We're gonna jinx. Alright, I'm proud to defeat him with the power of light! Baby. It's Gomez! There'll be no end to it if you can't get those bats away from it! Is that... Does that shit need light on this situation? Waka waka! Oh, there we go. Oh god, gonna need a little drink of my moo. Hold on, time out! Oh, that's some good shit right there. I need a little more! Mmm! Ah! Uh, gets you strong bonesy now! Okay, back to killing each other. Jesus Christ. Wow, this guy does not fuck around. Oh, come on. Hit him. Hit him. Hey, it now. There we go. God, these temples are fucking huge. Especially this one. Good lord, is there an end to it? There's another mini boss. There's like a third one here. Oh, there's the boss key. I haven't even found the boss room yet. Okay. Now, where's the room? I don't know. Don't fucking know. Whoa, these things drop a lot of rupees. Man, do I have to, like, backtrack all the fucking way to the start again? Come on, it's gotta be an easier way. Can I get back to the other side? Same where I'm supposed to fucking go. So fucking long, just get me out of here. Yeah, I gotta say, I'm definitely glad I had the Chateau Romani before coming in here. This really would've, really would've been a pain otherwise. It would've made it something that's already been a fairly frustrating dungeon even more frustrating. Oh, is this guy? Oh yeah, he grabs me and then he tosses me back in, doesn't he? Yep. 
How do I get over there? Ah! So confused! Fuck! How do I get into the fucking boss room? Or that room, even? Like, fuck! Let it end! I almost forgot to get this chest over here. God, do I just have to, like, slowly fall? Yeah, I think so. There we go. Okay, number 13. I think I know where the other two are now, but I have to turn the place over to get them. Look! Oh, use the hookshot of the chest there! Oh, okay. Okay, now I'm in... Oh. I don't have a key? Are you kidding me? I don't have a fucking key by this point? Fuck! Ah! Oh, I fucking hate this fucking place. Fuck. It's so fucking done, dude. Get this shit to fucking end. Kill me. I don't fucking care anymore. Just want to get fucking out of here. Okay, okay, I'm in an area I've been before. Fuck off! Oh, Jesus. Oh, okay, I see. So you flip it over and then he crushes himself into the floor. When you stand underneath him. When he comes down. Yeah. Oh. Got a chest over there. Okay, I'm just gonna be perfectly honest with you guys. This dungeon just goes is going on for way too fucking long. Seriously, I actually I, I just I want it to end. I just want it to fucking end. Like there's been some clever stuff, but there also has been so much fucking frustrating shit. Some of this stuff is so obscure and obtuse and just like and it just goes on for fucking ever. I just end already. Hell, you know, if you if you play this normally, you'd have to do this all in a single run, right? In a single save file. I guess unless you did, like, a temporary one, but... I mean, just, like, oh my god, like... I've already spent four hours playing this! Going... <laughs> trying to get through this fucking dungeon. It's episodes like this that fucking kill me, you know? Because they just fuck up my schedule, and then I, like, I just... I can't get the video ready when shit like this happens. And this game in particular has really been bad about that for with me. Like, yeah, I cut it down, and it's about an hour, maybe, or something, just to get that, that amount of content, but... But fuck me if it didn't take me freaking forever to get to that point. There's my key. Oh, okay, now what? Oh, Lord, another one of you things. Die, bitch! Oh, you're still alive. Ah, bleh. Oh, what? Another big item? Oh! You got the giant's mask. Within this mask lies the might of a giant, but can you use, use this power anywhere? What the hell? Seriously? Oh, hey, I got my final mask, aside from the final, final mask. Uh, oh. I can't equip it. If you wear it in a certain room, you'll grow into a giant. Oh, okay, cool. That sounds that sounds awesome. I shall turn into King Kong. Uh. Okay, now I'm in this area. Oh, this is probably how I was actually supposed to get this thing. I, I didn't need to ex to bomb it. Although I think it did save me a trip at least. Oh, there's the fucking boss room. Holy shit! Finally. I still haven't found all the fairies, but fuck it. I'll. Get them afterwards. I think I have to rotate the room again to get them anyway. Because I, I think that one is in that one chest that was... That I used to pull myself up. And I think another is in a... I think I, I unlocked another chest that was in... Back in that one other room, so... Alright, let's, uh... Let's just fucking do this. Oh, boy. Oh, God, where am I going? Where the crap is? Oh my god! 
Ah! Worm thing! Oh, two worm things! Giant mass insect twin mold. I think it's two of them, yeah. Oh, that's, oh God. Uh, do I need to use it on the boss or something? Oh, holy shit! Uh, yeah! Oh! What up, bitch? Yeah! It's your boy, Link! Uh, am I doing this right? Uh, bye. I'm not really sure, to be honest. Can I use big bombs? No. They make it sound. I don't know if I'm actually hurting him or not. <laughs> Holy shit, I am King fucking Kong, baby. Godzilla. I, uh... Yeah, I mean, they're making noise. I guess I am. I think I just got him in their head there. The, bot the rest of their body didn't seem to do anything. Yeah, yeah, I saw blue blood, yeah. I'm in them. This is working. Bump, 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 bump. Die, you dumb thing. Oh, there we go. That's one down. Boom. Now, number two. Oh, there he is. Oh, I can attack the tail, too. Oh, there we go! I did it! Alright, that was a... That was a pretty basic one. Once you understand that you just gotta put the, the mask on. You know what? I may be perfectly honest, I'm kinda glad it was basic. After the... fucking frustration I had with the rest of the dungeon, I, I kinda want basic. Don't forget my heart! Heart tank. Container. Okay. Yes, give me your head. See these twin mold remains. It's for the instant spirit this dark mask is kept in prison within the body of evil twin mold. Thank baby Jesus. All right, time to wake up the last of the four amigos. Um, <laughs> We've helped all of you. It's all we can do. You better help us, man. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Call us. That's what they're saying. We'll fuck out the Majora for you. That being told, we understand. So now you help us out in exchange. We'll call you from atop the clock tower. So do sing about them, alright? What? The voice sounds sad. You don't want to? Oh, uh, see, that story was true. They. So they were used to be friends with him, right? With the the imp kid. Four. Give. Your friend. Forgive our friend? What do you mean by forgive? Huh? What friend? We talking about? Hey, hey, listen. What the fuck's happening? I was getting rid of the undead or something. I I, I don't know. What's happening? Or maybe it's just saying the four giants were set free. I have no freaking clue. Either way, I still gotta find those fucking fairies. Whoa, what the oh god. Oh, okay. We're still we're still flipped over, I see. I was like, what's happening? Oh, I do not have a lot of time to do this. Only six more hours till we all die till we all die.
God, I'm sick, sick of playing this song already. Here's the one chest from before. Okay, that's number 14. Now the final one. Yep, it's in here. Okay, I think it actually might be underwater here. Where all this water go when I uh, did this before? Okay, there it is. Yep. Okay. And last but not least. Ah, oh, get the fuck out of here. Okay. Ready to get the shit out of here now. Oh, hey, you know just walking to people's houses? Oh! And she kicked me out. Interesting. Is her dad back to normal now? I didn't I didn't save him this time. I guess he is. I, I don't know if he, he was already back to normal after uh, I had already gotten the mask from before, or if it was because I what I do it at uh, Stone Tower Temple. Okay, lady. Give me ultimate power. Tell me my my freaking pain was not in vain. <laughs> oh, oh my god, my ears yellow! Hello there, I'm the Fairy of Bananas! Have you been getting enough calcium, young man? Yes, thank you. Yes, actually, I've been drinking a lot of milk. Great Fairy of Kindness! So, oh. thank you for returning my broken shattered body to normal. <laughs> Return, I give you the power of kindness! Here's a pat on the back! <laughs> fuck you, bitch! Just take out my sword, stab the fuck out of her. <laughs> Six, I cry you the Fairy Sword! What? Oh, what? Get the Great Fairy Sword! Set it to use- oh. I gotta set it to use it? Is it stronger than the thing I've already gotten? I like how this- you're the great fairy of kindness and you give me a sword. <laughs> this- treat your foes with kindness! Murderous, murderous kindness! With black roses etched into it, the great fairy sword is the most powerful of all blades. Okay, well then I guess it is! Come see me whenever you're overcome by weariness! Almost makes you wonder why you spent all that time getting that other sword! Motherfucker! What the shit? Most powerful sword of Black Rose etched into it. Brandish it. Oh, sweet, yeah! Oh, wait. Oh, okay, I gotta... So, okay, so it's kind of like the Goron sword from, uh, Ocarina of Time. It requires two hands. And I block... I can't block at all. Oh, wait. I can I can stand and take the attack. I can drop my guard entirely and be like, hit me! Hit me I'm right here! <laughs> That's good. Sort of awkward for me because I have the, the C stick or the C buttons uh on my joystick, so it's like I gotta press the joystick to the to the left to to swing the sword. Sweet. You know the game's almost over, right? So I don't know how useful this is gonna be by this point. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. That was that was a really frustrating dungeon, I'm gonna be honest. I, I did not terribly enjoy that. It, it just went on to way too freaking long. I, I felt like the first two dungeons in this game were, were good, nice challenges, but just the right like, like length and stuff where they didn't overstay their welcome. The third one went on a little long, but it had some frustrating moments, but still had some clever puzzles. This one, oh, I don't know. I think I actually might have disliked this one even more than I like disliked the last one. I. I really got frustrated by this one. There were a lot of really obscure, kind of like, I don't know, kind of dick puzzles, honestly. Like, they felt more like crapshoots than like any form of logic. Like, the developers were just trying to like piss you the fuck off. And seriously, so many mini bosses in it. It just, and it just went on forever. And I get it. It's like it's supposed to be the final dungeon, right? The, the big grand finale. And they probably want to make it feel like you're, you're, uh, you're gonna run out of time and stuff, and I, I definitely understand that. It's just, oh, I mean, the fact that even a normal player would have to play it all in a single session, uh, it just seems like it's too much, you know? Just too freaking much for any one session, and it just, it just wasn't that fun. The, the boss fight was okay. It wasn't exactly the most exciting or interesting, but honestly, I was actually kind of thrilled when it was just really easy. Just put the mask on and beat the shit out of him, because... The rest of the dungeon was such a grind, especially there was so much backtracking and going back to to the previous rooms, trying to find shit. Stressful. That's what that last dungeon was. Incredibly stressful, which really kind of sucks. And I, and I I hate to say this because I'm afraid I'm probably gonna get shit for this. I know a lot of people were like, oh, this last dungeon. The I think some people thought the last dungeon was gonna be like really awesome. So I'm like, 
And I, I, I'm a little surprised that I don't like it as much as I, I thought I would. You know, people were saying, if everyone seemed to think, like, agree that, okay, the Water Temple was, like, the worst or not very good. But it's not like a lot of people really liked this next one, and I don't know, I really did not like it personally, and I, I'm sorry to say that. That's just my honest opinion. I don't know. I'll be curious to see what other people think. I, I think the best parts of this game so far really have been the the interactions with other characters and those little side quests. I, I really think those have been the best parts of the game, but then when it comes to like the regular Zelda stuff, it's, it's tough. It's just, it's a lot harder, and in some ways, kind of dickish. <laughs> in, in particular with the last two dungeons. The first two, like I said, were, were okay, but uh, it's just, and it, but it's been making it really difficult for me too, in particular with recording. Just, you know, getting these episodes out on a daily basis. I'm not gonna be able to get this out tomorrow, I'm just not. It's, it's too late again. And I know some of you are probably like, well, why don't you just, you know, stop when you feel like you're ready? But the, the problem is it's gonna be too short of an episode, you know, and I, I try to get enough for at least an hour or maybe a little over when it ends up being like really long and hard to figure things out and I mean stuff's gonna get inevitably cut out but it doesn't mean it's uh makes it any easier for me you know it still ends up taking me many many hours so yeah this ended up being four and a half hours for me hope you guys understand you're not like too frustrated with me I'm sorry if I, I didn't play it right or I didn't or maybe I, I should have figured things out e more easily but hopefully my frustration is at least sort of understandable. Um, anyway, guys, I hope you all still enjoy this episode, regardless of my uh, my my nagging frustration. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite. It really does help me out. And subscribe if you're not already become Piggy Penguin. Boy, this will be where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. Ooh, ooh, this makes me kind of want to like take a break from like games like this where recording's just going for f fucking ever. You know. I need something easier to record for like a while because this shit's just like, it's just burning me out, honestly. Anyway, guys, as always, till next time, stay classy.